Hey, it's Mitch from PickDogs.com here with your free pick in the Rockies versus Braves Major League Baseball matchup on Sunday, August 11th, 2024. If you like all the free picks we do at PickDogs, you'll love our premium picks. Those are our best bets. You can find them over at PickDogs.com under the premium picks tab. Of course, uh, I also got a link in the description directly below this video. Make it nice and easy. Of course, uh, if you make big bets, $1,000 or more, you got a bankroll of $10,000 or more, then uh, text the number you see on the screen for our VIP packages. Of course, it's just a select portion of our audience that that's, you know, the right product for. Our regular premium picks are the most popular. I bet mine every day, even though I make big bets. And of course, we got more free picks than everyone at Pick Dogs. But anyways, let's get to it. We got the Rockies taking on the Braves. And, uh, you know, the Braves really hobbling here down the stretch. Right now, I mean, it's it's a wild card, maybe, if they can turn things around in a hurry. Meanwhile, the Rockies, just another season they would like to forget. And uh, while they certainly, we see them, you know, rise to the occasion at times, this is a team that's 30 games plus under 500 at this point in the season, while the Braves barely hanging above 500. It's just such a such an odd thing. The Braves go with Schwellenbach in this one. And, of course, this is all part of the issue. And he's not a horrible pitcher. I'm not saying that he's a problem or anything like that. What I'm saying is that, you know, he wasn't a guy that figured to be part of the rotation uh, coming into the season. And the Braves have just been hampered by injuries up and down the roster on both sides, you know, on the pitching and on position players. When you lose your best pitcher and your best position player in the same season, it's pretty tough. But the Braves have won four of Schwelly's last five starts. He comes in with a 4.04 ERA. He has a lot of nine home runs over 64 and two-thirds innings. He struck out 70 batters over that span. He's got a 3.15 ERA over his last three starts. For the Rockies, it's uh, Kyle Freeland on the ball on the mound for this one. Freeland, of course, homegrown product for the for the Rockies, but in uh, you know, he's from Colorado. But the thing is that when he came off the injured list, he was pitching really, really well. But since then, Ah, not quite the same guy that we saw over that. I'm not sure what it was that, um, you know, inspired him like that. But, uh, you know, he needs to try and find that again. His last three starts have not been as impressive. He's got a 5.65 ERA on the season. He's struck out 55 batters through 63 and a seven and uh, two-thirds innings. He's allowed nine home runs o- over, the, over the course of the year. But over his last three starts, it's a 5.74 ERA for Kyle Freeland. We look at the way these teams are hitting the baseball and the Braves against left-handed pitching, which Freeland is over their last 10 games, hitting 241, while the Rockies against right-handed pitching hitting just 214. The Braves bullpen has not been good. And I mean, the Braves who are known as an organization that really, you know, prides themselves on top-notch pitching, the ERA of the bullpen over their last 10 games and during this really bad skid 4.72, while the Rockies bullpen, 5.36. At least they play, you know, a lot of games in Colorado in the altitude, so that at least they have an excuse. You know, I, the Braves have dominated the Rockies over time, but they've been playing so poorly coming in. You know, the thing is, I think this is one that I think the Braves salvage one. I'm going to take the Braves, and that's going to be my free pick. Of course, while you're doing your picks, putting your bets in, use our betting tools at sportschatplace.com. 100% free, and they'll help put you on the most favorable bets on the board today.